Folks at Nine, two utility companies are warning you tonight about phone scams targeting their customers. Both Alabama Power and Spire have said that criminals are using their companies to try to steal your financial information. We're Lauren Harkson on your side tonight after talking with both companies. What are they saying, Lauren? Well, Brittany. Or, unfortunately, scammers are trying anything and everything to steal your information and your money. Now, in these two cases, both phone scams, criminals are calling customers claiming they have an outstanding balance. Alabama Power says in the latest variation of this old con, scammers are actually using some parts of your own account information trying to trying to trick you. Anthony Cook says they then demand immediate payment by a credit debit or money card, warning that your service will be disconnected if you don't pay up. We will never pressure you to give your information over the phone. Uh, we will never ask you for an alternative form of payment like a money card. Uh, and we're never going to ask you for your bank account information. Now, as far as Spire customers go, this scam becomes a bit more interesting. The scammer will call, claim the account is delinquent and needs payment, just like the last one. But this time, the scammer will then call Spire poses the customer and make a fake payment using a closed account. This way, the customer will see a pending payment, believing that they actually were talking to Spire previously. But unfortunately, the money from the scammer, of course, will not go through. There will still be an outstanding balance for the real customer to pay, and the scammer now has access to your financial information. So it can impact, you know, their, their account. Um, and maybe upcoming travel, upcoming presence, upcoming purchases. It's just a, a big inconvenience for everybody, obviously. And we just want to make sure that our customers are aware that there are instances like that. Now, if you get a call from either utility company and are unsure if the call is actually real or fake, they both recommend just hang up and call either Alabama Power or Spire's direct line.